Ja. There's been some talk about how the food and the service is not as good anymore, so we're gonna check it out, see what's popping. All right, I went to go get a menu for Dell so she could take 30,000 hours to decide what she wants. So wait, Cromart's prices is getting a little, a little out of hand. It's almost $20 for some salmon. That's... How much do you remember? I think it was like $15.99. I don't think it's a big deal. I feel like $18.99, or salmon lichen with Cajun spices is an extra 50 cents. <laughs> Your face. I don't See? think the camera caught that. See, they did. <laughs> See how they doing out here? I mean, they're on the south side now. They've been in the game for a couple years now. You know, when you first start off, you do start off a little bit more on the lower end. You know, you're working out the tweaks and stuff like that. Like, it, it makes sense to me. I've been told you don't do that. I feel like it's completely reasonable as a new business to start off lower. And as you get better, as your recipes get better. Are you talking about karma just in general? Because I business, feel like. Yeah, the business of. of Period. Uh, okay, well, I don't want to talk about that. Ain't okay. nothing different about Karma. They still serve the same black and they still serve the same mac and cheese. They still serve yeah, the know, same like, hit changed? or miss yams. Not necessarily. You don't know that. We, if you can't say without reservation that their yams are sometimes good, sometimes not so good. But that's like any restaurant. Like every restaurant. That like wasn't what Karma was like when we first started going there. That's the whole premise of this video. Like you gotta go Dick with the karma of business. Fall like, off. That's the question we gonna answer. No, Bam. they didn't fall off. And I ain't even tried their food, you know. What well, last time we had their food was, I don't know. But they ain't fall off. So this is what I mean. It's $18.99 for the salmon, right. plus 50 cents if you wanna blacken it, plus a dollar if you wanna side. No, it's like, no. Well, it's a dollar for, it's an extra dollar for a super salad. That's what I just said. No, you said for a side. You come with two sides. Oh yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. You, my bad, my bad. Players mess up too, players mess up too. Karma is out of control. No, they're not. And this food, I feel like it's gonna taste the same way. It I always know. tastes. I'm gonna let you know if these yams is fire but, or if but, these but yams is out, weak. But check this out, So they know that their macaroni and cheese and their yams are, are like big, right? Everybody loves those too. So instead of charging you an, an, another 459 for a double side of macaroni and cheese, they're just saying, give us one more dollar and we can give you double macaroni and cheese. Can they get some cool points? If they give me double. Carmi charges an extra dollar if you want two sides of macaroni and cheese. They gotta scoop it twice, but they want an extra dollar. Dell was looking like, yeah, that's that's it. So we gonna talk about it um, later. Anyway, so we about to go in here and get popping. It is. 329. We'll update y'all when we sit down and we'll tell you when we get the food. Hey guys, how you doing today? What's up, boss? Y'all hear the, the music? We can't leave it in here too long. You feel me? So, we just got the order in. It's 356. No, but you're being unfair. No, no, no. I, I got it. Listen. Relax. We just put the order in. Time is... Alright guys, enjoy. Thanks. There's no reason to love this song like that. No, if they play that, then it's a rush. All right, food is done, and now we need to talk about this experience. Honestly, I think what people are saying is true. Um, their prices have gone up, and the food is not always as good. I had to send my salmon back, which is, I, I don't knock karma for that. I mean, that happens to me all the time. But they doing a little nickel and dime on the menu. No. I think for me, I kind of want to balance it out with the fact that I think sometimes people just need a reason to complain. Yeah, I, 
And I think- Here you go with this people stuff. We're two people. Let but everybody... I'm speaking to the fact that because of all of that, uh -huh. then it makes me want to go a little bit harder on the, you know, being objective and being fair and being- but Like just, what did you think about it? Don't even take other people. You don't have to take other people's whatever into account. I can if I You're want doing to. the same thing with the Millie Rock video. You letting the outsiders- Will you influence? please let that go? I will say, I feel like the soup usually has more of a punch to it and the spice, it was really subtle. The macaroni and cheese is usually feels more home, home cooked, homemade. It was a little bit more um, mellow dark. than what I'm used to. The sweet potatoes, you know, I had to send mine back, but yours were good. So I'm pretty sure the ones that they sent back out were good. And I'm not knocking them for me having it. They weren't good. Yes, they were. My sweet potatoes were um, better than they usually are, but they were a little more overcooked than they should have been. Well, yeah, I guess. I mean, I don't want to be nitpicky, but I mean, the food is a little different, but like, I wonder, are they becoming a little bit more mainstream? Like, Here's my thing. The food used to be fire. That's all I have to uh, compare it against. It was good every single time we went there. And then after a while, the yam started to fall off. It was like, well, that's disappointing. But it's like, come on, man. You, I feel like as much as I like them, I like Carlene. I like Mike. I don't deal with Mike too much. We usually deal with Carlene. I, I'm a fan of their business. Um, I feel like we will continue to patronize them in some way. But it's not as good as it used to be, and it costs more. They move locations. Maybe that has something to do with it. Maybe they feel like uh, they can milk more of their white patrons because um, slavery. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> It just, it just is yeah, what it I is. Think that's important to note. You know, they are in a different location. This is the South Side. In case you forgot, this is Detroit. You know, who knows? What how movie much is that from? I know where it is. Well, from. yeah, I'm not asking you. Oh, okay. I'm asking you. What movie is I that from? I wonder if anybody will be able to know. I wonder if, if it's a matter of business. Everything Should your product go down, too? No, I don't know. No, the product shouldn't go down in any way, shape, or form. I thought like we got to try one more time. All right, to be continued. Yeah. You heard it here first. Today could have been just another, you know, off day. Part three. Boom.